Inside Edition with Deborah Norville. Hello, everybody, and thank you for joining us. It's still not clear what prompted Beyonce's sister, Solange, to explode in anger against Jay-Z inside that elevator at the Standard Hotel. But here's the latest on what we're hearing today. It's Beyonce's message to the world. She and her sister remain as tight as ever after that shocking elevator attack on husband Jay-Z. Beyonce seemed to extend the olive branch. Beyonce posted these tender photos of her with her little sis to her Instagram account at 6 a.m. this morning. She left the captions blank, but her message of love and maybe forgiveness was obvious. The four photos became an immediate social media sensation, receiving 200,000 likes in just the first two hours. In another show of family solidarity, Jay-Z and Solange reportedly went shopping together at Mr. Flawless Jewelry Shop in Midtown Manhattan on Tuesday. Solange and Jay-Z, apparently, they're fine. Hmm. Jewelry shopping tonight. Uh, and by the way, a little yeah. bit of a confession. We can actually see that jewelry store from this building, and some members of the Kelly ah. Kyle spotted them together. New explanations for Solange's astonishing caught-on-video attack are emerging. The New York Daily News reports that the 27-year-old singer flew into a rage because Jay-Z wanted to ditch her and Beyonce to go to an after-party thrown by none other than Rihanna, who was quite a presence that night at the Met Gala. Revenge, says the front page. Why does your husband need to go to the club right now, the paper quotes Solange is asking Beyonce. Jay-Z is said to have snapped back, you're one to talk. That's when Solange went ballistic, punching, kicking, and spitting at the rap mogul inside the elevator at the swanky Standard Hotel in Lower Manhattan. Before the blow-up, Solange was described as drunk and out of it. There were a few altercations where she was drinking a bit too much, she was sort of arguing with people, um, and they ended up having to leave. Solange's hair trigger temper has been seen in public before. In a 2008 live TV interview, Solange lost it when she was asked about Jay-Z. Please don't tie me into a family and my brother-in-law's establishment. She once tweeted, I don't believe in violence, but I almost beat someone's blank tonight. We're also learning more about the bodyguard who found himself in the middle of the elevator fight. He's Beyonce's longtime bodyguard, Julius DeBoer. And he's with her everywhere she goes. We caught up with E! News correspondent Alicia Quarles. I don't know if we're ever going to know what really happened. These are people that are masters at PR. They only let out what they want to let out, and they capitalized on it. Today they announced more tour dates. That's smart PR.